Hello, brothers and sisters, this is Lisa, and I'm here to share the latest word given to Ali Winters. The title is, All Will Testify Against You, and this was posted June 14th of 2019. It will not be pretty, this death of a nation. Many will testify against her in days to come. America's beauty has been tarnished, stained by the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eye, and the pride of life. 1 John 2.16 Her stains evident, condemned by her actions, betrayed by clergy and politician alike. America rejects truth and morality as she embraces those who call evil good and good evil, who put darkness for light and light for darkness. Who put bitter for sweet and sweet for bitter. Isaiah 5.20 The transgender movement. Churches singing praises to Mama God and Mama Ghost. Abortion on demand. Pockets of resistance. Preachers of truth. People of faith pray. Petition. Intercede on your behalf to no avail. El Shaddai presented as the double-breasted one, instead of God all-sufficient. Bestiality, homosexuality paraded in nation after nation, all will testify against you. You boast in your arrogant schemes. All such boasting is evil. If anyone then knows the good they ought to do and doesn't do it, it is sin for them. James 4, verses 16 and 17. America, for too long you have stood against the ways of God. In rebellion and disobedience, you have planted much, but harvested little. You eat, but never have enough. You drink, but never have your fill. You put on clothes, but are not warm. You earn wages, only to put them in a purse with holes in it. Haggai 1.6 You have robed yourself in rags, thinking yourself a king. You danced to the music of madmen. You have planted seeds of discord and hostility, becoming gullible and greedy, yet you say, I am rich, I have acquired wealth, and do not need a thing. But you do not realize that you are wretched, pitiful, poor, blind, and naked. Revelation 3.17 I see your sins, says the Sovereign Lord. I see your rejection of my truth at the expense of your own soul. I see how your choices have destroyed the lives of others. I warn of danger ahead. You remain unaffected. I caution you to prepare. You charge ahead unconcerned and unafraid. I see, yet I have remained silent until now. I have given her time to repent of her immorality, but she is unwilling. Revelation 2, verse 21. I am not blind to your ways nor hard of hearing as you speak lies in my name. Your sins have not gone unnoticed, and be assured they will not go unpunished. A day of reckoning is coming. The nation, the church, all who have chosen to ignore my truth will no longer be able to ignore my power, my authority, my righteousness as my judgment comes. And that is the end of the message. Please, everyone, repent. Call on the name of Jesus today if you have not. God bless each and every one of you. I pray you all have a beautiful day in the Lord. Keep looking up. Keep praying for family and loved ones. God bless you all, and I will see you either next video or in the air. Bye-bye.